Hello, welcome to LEV Toys. I have got a new build for you today. It is one of the latest releases of the Disney Princess Lego line. This is the Arendelle Birthday Celebration Castle. And obviously it's come from the Frozen Fever uh, short movie where it's Anna's birthday. So we get to set all up for Anna's birthday party. So let's do that. Let's have a look inside first. We've got a very, very thick instruction book and one little sheet of stickers and let's have a look at the mini dolls so first up we have Elsa and Elsa is in her frozen fever spring wear here now the color green of her dress is not the same color green I don't think they've matched it very well to the movie at all but um, the patterning is pretty good and she's got a lovely long cape there she also comes with a scepter because after all she is the ice princess she needs something big and spectacular and she also gets a bolt of ice as well a big icicle of ice and that's all made her very forward heavy so she keeps trying to topple forwards hmm <laughs> before I fix that there's also a new little design of crown here like a little tiara that goes on the top of her head and she's entirely decked out and still falling forward no, no I think I've got her balance now so there's Elsa and now we are going to build Anna. So Anna actually is probably my favorite mini doll from this set. She uh, pinched her out of bag two because she's not in bag one. But here she is, she's in her frozen fever outfit as well. And I think she looks really, really pretty. I love the hair hairstyle and I'm trying to shove it on here properly. There we go, I love her hair, the updo with all of the braids around. And she even gets a flower for the back just like she would for the movie, but should have ribbons for it hanging down, but we won't be sticklers for, for, uh, for authenticity here because after all, it is a Lego set. And it also comes with Olaf, Olaf. And here he is. He's got his little button and he's got a nose. There we go. He's just like we saw in the previous Lego Frozen sets. Not any modification for him, but this one also comes with three little snogies. Look, one little snogie. Two little, oops, hold on, the first snogies trying to get away. Two little snogies and three little snogies. Oh, and they're very cute and they jump all over everything and they cause a whole heap of mischief. There's only three of them, but they really can create a lot of mischief. So there are all our minifigures and dolls in this one. We're going to move them over and we're going to start building the pieces. So first up, we're building what looks like flowers but they're not actually flowers there are a whole heap of balloon party sets released this season and they're in these pretty pastels of light purple and pale blue and a beautiful pink and we have two sets of balloons there for Anna's birthday we've lined her up beautifully inside and also the birthday celebration table with a couple of fancy cups and she also needs some things to eat here so we have got four frosted cupcakes here very delicious and this interesting looking layered thing here can you guess what it is yes it is the cake and it even gets a depiction of the sunflowers on it with the green and the little yellow flower on the top of all the sunflowers there is a very big theme for frozen fever there so there's her beautiful frozen fever birthday cake and the, the, oh, the snow all right <laughs> between snogies and olaf i don't think this set's going to have very much uh, sense to it as we build it but we'll try to make it as sensible as possible and this is a present look she's getting a bow Shh, don't tell her a new bow for her hair and we know it's a present because we're putting the present sticker on the top and we'll tuck it over there ready for anna's celebration and these cute little things are stools to sit around the birthday party table. So there are two of them. And let's start building the actual platform of the castle, the spring castle. So even though it is a spring castle, there are all these ice uh, and snow elements, as well as all the gorgeous pastel flowers. So it's a lovely combination of snow and ice and spring and flowers. It's really nice. It's great juxtaposition. I love it. And I do love these new colored flowers with the pale blue. Very, very pretty. Now we're currently inside and this little piece here is a mat, a very comfy, 
tapestry mat and there's a birthday party invitation sitting right there next to the mat. Not certain why there is a birthday party invitation inside the house but we are now up to bag two and we're going to keep building the first floor of the Celebration Castle. Elsa and Anna need to hop out of the way because we need to put some windows in. I can't decide whether to leave them open or shut. Is it hot? Is it cold? Do we let the air in? Do we keep the air out? Just can't decide but we can see the girls really well through those through those windows. They're really cute little lattice windows. It's very charming. It's all very princessy, very fairy tale princessy. I really like that. So on this wall we have the famous picture from the big hallway in their castle, as you'll remember it from the movie. And we're back on the outside now and we get to hang up some some bunting. Oh, such pretty bunting. I love the colour schemes. I just love it all. It's very pastel and very festive. And you can see this is a very high, tall, arched doorway. We're building the door at the moment. Very substantial door for the front of the castle, which is important if you are princesses and queens because you need to keep all of the riffraff out. <laughs> and the stickers need to go on in a certain direction so we need to pay attention to which way the stripes are going. I think that's right. That's good and that clicks on here and oh when we shut it we just smacked poor Anna over but she's all right she's okay. She's a very strong woman. Now now that the doors open again we can build some more of the interior here and this interesting looking thing is hiding some ice skates for Anna's birthday. You know how you have to hide the presents all around the house? so that they can't be found. Well, here's the ice skates. They're hidden in the grandfather clock. And I think, um, I think Anna's just found them. Whoops, well they were supposed to be a surprise for your birthday, Anna. <laughs> she probably shouldn't have been watching while we built it. Some very pretty flowers for the corner. And we also need a little, a little lounge for the corner too. An extra bed, somewhere comfy to lie when they're tired. Now you can see that this is taking very good shape as a fireplace. You can see the glowing embers in the bottom and I do love all the stickers. There are a lot of stickers to put on in this set. <laughs> I'm having a hard time getting them all straight but that's really pretty. Back out the front again. It's time for some more building up. And look at this feature. It's a slippery slide from the second store, or from the second story of, of the castle and everybody, oh my goodness, would you all just get out of the way? I'm trying to build here. Olaf, Snogies, hop out of the way. <laughs> right, and we've got some more, not certain what these are supposed to be. Are they more icicles? Are they uh, snowy? Snogies, hop, hop out of the way. I'm serious. And you too, Anna. Might be your birthday, but you all need to hop out of the way. Oh, Elsa, not you as well. I thought you were the sensible one. You were the sensible one. We're up to bag three. Oh my goodness me. Second story now. Now we can find out how they actually get up to that slide and how they can get down it too. Look at all these lovely pale mint green pieces. I love that. It's one of my favorite colors. The pale mint and the fuchsia pink go beautifully together. So much pretty, so very pretty. We have some more decoration up here. We're heading up, 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 up. There are lots of little turrets and peaks in here and little archways. It's a beautiful design. Some more snowy windows here, or icy windows. We'll put the girls up in here so they can watch, they can supervise, they can see how our build of their castle is going. And the snow geese are there too, I'm not certain that they're going to supervise very effectively, but we'll keep them there so we know what they're up to. We'll move them over a bit because we've got some more things to build here and they're going to be in the way. Now this is Anna's own personal fireplace for her room, for her bedroom. And it sits over here, and that snogie needs to hop out of the way so it doesn't melt in the fire. And this is her vanity table. 
and it's got a lovely rug in between there. She's just going to warm her hands by the glowing fire. Ah, I've just put a piece on the rock. There we go. I wondered why that piece was missing. I can tell you now, if you are missing a piece in your Lego set, there's a very good chance that it's either still stuck in the plastic bag or that you've put it on somewhere else in the wrong spot. I do it all the time. I love this door. I love it. Look at the patterns on it and it has a lock on it. So it goes here. It's either the lock into Anna's room or it's the lock to keep Anna out of Elsa's room, which is this little ice room next door. I'm not certain what it's for. What do you think? Is it to keep Anna out or is it to stop Elsa from getting in? Hmm, can't decide. Bag number four. We finished Elsa's ice room. That's all she gets. She just gets flowers on an icy platform. And Anna's trying to get in and it looks like, see, she can get in. She just fell out the door. But I wonder if it will also keep Elsa out. <laughs> I'm unsure. Let's keep building up, up, up. more little decorative pieces up the top as well and these little glass windows get little curtains in them little sticker curtains and they're facing outwards more little peaks one more curtained window right at the top and we also need the last few peaks to be pointy right at the top and a snowflake a big beautiful snowflake you can see how big it is in comparison to Anna it's almost the same size as she is now in this spot here it's the last bit we have left to build it's Anna's bed and it's a very fancy one it's a very princessy bed it has four posters and a little arch and a peak over the top and some decoration which I haven't put on straight <laughs> there we go now that's straight and that is fancy, and it doesn't look very comfortable at all. Poor Anna, she's hanging off the end. What am I doing wrong here? Surely she shouldn't hang off the end. Uh, she's going to go and ask Elsa. Elsa, what do you think? Should I fit on this bed? <laughs> I don't know. Right, so we got... Actually, I lie. It's not the last thing that we need to build. We've got more decoration on the front here. Some icicles. They're very pretty. And down the bottom, we have got the two big ice sculptures that Elsa magics the watery fountains into. So she's going to magic this other one too. Matching ice sculptures for Anna's birthday. Now we're done. So this is the whole castle. All the way to the top, that was the front, and all the way down the inside. It's really very pretty, and there's really a lot of fun play we can have inside this. So let's have a look. Oh, here we have uh, Elsa, she's getting ready for the birthday party. This is her magicking, oh, oh <laughs> magicking the ice sculptures. No, she's wondering what on earth's going on with the snow geese. Anna is still sleeping, and Elsa's coming in. That lock obviously isn't working on the door. And she's waking Anna up, and she does fit. Anna does fit on the bed when you take her. Oops, she just fell on Anna. When you take her hairpiece out. So there we go. When the little flowers out, and Anna, it's your birthday! Yay! Woo! And they're both very excited. It's very exciting. Birthdays are awesome. And now she needs to get dressed. She's dressed already, really. But she needs to put her hair ornament in so she's ready for the day. And Elsa is bringing her out the front. I'm sure she's got her eyes closed. We can't close her eyes at all. And yay, look, she's seen all the fabulous things that Elsa has organized for her. And she's giving her a great big hug. And now she's running off to investigate the birthday party goodness. Oh, my goodness. Right, yep. Off you go to Elsa. And here she is opening her present. And Elsa's got the first cupcake of the day ready for her to eat. And Olaf's looking on too. They were all very excited. And it's cheers for everybody. And oh, the snow geese have got cupcakes all over them. And Olaf's got one over his nose. Oh dear. I think the party might be over now. They're inside eating the leftovers of the birthday cake. And uh, oh, oh, you sneezed. Oh, too many sneezes, Elsa. Too many sneezes. There are snow geese everywhere. <laughs> Oh my goodness, all right, that's just too silly. But isn't it beautiful? It's a beautiful birthday castle. I really, really like it. What do you think? Do you like it too? Leave me a comment, let me know. Don't forget to subscribe too, click like, check out some of our other silly videos, and I'm gonna see you again for another one really, really soon.